everyone's really happy, you know, free food and, and everyone friendly and dancing and getting everyone involved. All, you know, it's all over town, everyone knows what's going on and it's a really good thing for Karatha, I think. Yeah, it's sort of, it's a bit of a coming of age in a way to have a display village. And it's a great pleasure to officially open your Baden West display village today. This project signals that we are normalising the market, that there is choice in both uh, type of housing and the price point uh, of the housing and uh, I think it's great that uh, families here in Karatha can come and uh, walk down the road, look at 17 different housing choices and uh, as of today they can still uh, sign the contract and be looking to move in as soon as the builders have built it. Uh, that sounds like uh, a city's uh, on the move. This is the first of its kind in the Pilbara, so it'll be fantastic for people all throughout the Pilbara to come and have a look at some homes in person, choose something and then go and build it. I think it shows that, that there is a real demand for this product in the Pilbara. People are wanting to create a home here and uh, this is going to allow them to do that. It's awesome, yeah, it's really good because it gives you some great ideas and it's, it's good to be able to actually look inside the home to see what it looks like finished rather than just look at a plan. I guess we get a, a look from the ground up get to see what's what's coming up and available. We're not from here, we're from Canada. So it's kind of interesting to see what kind of houses that you guys have here. People can, through this display, can have uh, house and land packages from $500,000 to seven or $800,000. But I think importantly, the choice that's here will enable us to break that, that million dollar headline barrier, which uh, seems to be always quoted to us as being the housing cost in Carapa. To make this happen, we need to obviously have the builders uh, on board and they need to believe, because they make huge investments in these properties, build a confidence in an estate like this is, is in, incredibly important. With this idea of the Pilbara Cities coming on board, it's a, it's a really important initiative and we're, obviously we're behind that as a group and we stand to benefit from it as well and see a benefit to the community, so we, we just, we're here for the long run. 24,000 uh, homes are needed if we're going to grow to 50,000 people. I think that the resource sector and the growth of the community means that there will be demand for that and I think that this is the first step in uh, what might be into the future multiple display home precincts, multiple building options be it uh, standalone homes or be it uh, apartment living in, uh, in a more densified uh, area close to the CBD.